Here's where the video starts with the one leaf commander. I've got the board there in the thicket amongst all the small trees. Probably one of the worst sets of circumstances for night vision. And down he goes. So how well does the one leaf handle recoil? Check it out, no screen flicker here. Looks like all of the electronics are well hardened. So the first hog with the One Leaf Commander NV400 and the Automax 500 is a 150 pound boar. Moving on to the next property, been to spite some hogs out in this field. We've got a small sounder that's quite spread out. And I'm coming online with the One Leaf Commander. We already know what I'm shooting from the previous video. We know that Ben is shooting Northern Precision 95 grain Spitzer RBT bullets out of the 6.5 Grindle. Now on the left you see my screen flicker. That's because I'm cycling the IR light, um, adjusting the power level on it. Shooter ready, shooter ready, you're at a butt. Wait till you brought There you go. Three, two, one. 85 yards through the trees or 150 yards okay, out in the open down. field. Here's no down. problem for the One Leaf Commander in V400. Safe. Safe. Here's the full screen on the One Leaf Commander. Three, two, one. Well, yours is down. Yours is down. Fist bump. Fist bump. Boom. Boom. Here, Ben is pointing to the tiny entry hole made by the 6.5 Grindle, and for the 500 Automax, you can tell where I hit the pig, no problem. Brass Catcher by Tactical Brass Recovery. Came away with two hogs. Mine was a 170 pound sow down at 150 yards. Ben was a 190 